you for your uh, time today. Can I interrupt you and wish you a Nyama? Yes. Galaba. <laughs> Galaba. <laughs> I think today, today yes. we would like to give you a book to ask you about the Myanmar food. Right. Can you give up the idea about the culture according to the food in general in all the first? So uh, if we want to talk about the main food, okay, yes. we would say rice and curry. Pasa mm -hmm. pama, rice and curry. Tamin is rice. Rice and uh, curry is in this curry. That, that is the staple, staple food. So and in every meal have rice and curry? Yeah, yeah every meal, morning and evening. Mm -hmm. Morning rice and evening. Okay. The main food, because you asked about the staple. Yes, right? staple. So we eat uh, as a main dish, mm -hmm. as a main dish. But these, uh, earlier we talked about onida and all. Mm -hmm. This is the, like a fat dish, okay. right? Like we eat as something uh, in addition to the rice. Like we may have some celebration. Your birthday, you may have some homo cosplay. Oh. And uh, you asked me about the culture. At the Burmese table, the head of the, the table would be the father mm -hmm. okay, or mother. And then we would offer, you know, this as is the rever reverence, you know, we would put the dish onto the plate. So this is the manner on the table. Right, right. manner. Both yeah. for the senior. Senior, right. Yes, yes, yes. You have another manner while doing the eating? Huh? Like, like, like how, what? How you eat? Oh, how we, we eat with fingers. With fingers, okay. Right, we eat with fingers. Uh, how about another? You have spoon or fork sometimes? Yeah, yeah. They are spoon and fork. Mm -hmm. But with the soup and all, we use the spoon, soup spoon to drink. Mm -hmm. oh, chopsticks. 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 Uh, there are some Chinese people who use, but we don't use chopsticks. Not my people, not very. The but, they, but nowadays, even my own sons, they are using chopsticks when they eat uh, some special food like cow Ah, okay. So the hands. <laughs> if we talk about the influence uh, of the food in Burma, what do you say? What, which country oh, okay. you are good? Like we had earlier said from India, because uh, as you know, if you go to the Indian restaurant, you would see that uh, their food are quite oily. Yes, right. So, and there is another dish called dambak, which is actually derived from India. It's a copy. Kamonkai. So uh, similar. Similar. So and then, like you can said, from China, like elsewhere. How about rice? What kind of rice do you normally uh, have? We have different variety of rice. It's the same as the same uh, yes, the name is eaten by the majority. The name of the rice is called or san hoi. Or san hoi. What is it? Uh, it's similar. White rice. Uh, white rice. This is jasmine rice? No, 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 no not rice. jasmine rice. That's basmati rice. is, we use basmati when we make damba kaman thai. Oh, we use basmati. something related to So that's rice. the reason, uh, to answer your previous question, uh, we got the influence from India, and when they make dambao, uh, the dambao bariyani in, in, in Indian name is bariyani, they use basmati rice. But like she had earlier said, uh, everybody, like uh, before this jasmine rice was introduced, we used for some oil, and then shivadi yamkao sarayani,
like uh, Kalmyan bao, we have white sticky rice and brown and black sticky rice. Okay. So, but the main rice that you use white rice? Yes, white rice. So you have rice in every meal, breakfast, lunch, and dinner? Rice and curry in every meal? Yeah, yeah, yeah. rice and curry. But like uh, we earlier said, in the early morning we may eat main job or main mm -hmm. mm -hmm. So what is your main meal? Mm -hmm. if, uh, morning breakfast? Mm -hmm. uh, we we have like a uh, morning breakfast. But for me, uh, for me, I don't like eating heavy rice in the morning. I don't. Mm -hmm. I just have bread, uh, butter, and coffee. That may be the British influence of yes. Oh. This is this is for me. But people uh, uh, from different walks of life, as you may well know. So when people uh, not very much high society, just been ordinary people, uh, and they may like to eat this pebble and tomato for morning or morning. Okay. And That's then like the main dish would be in the afternoon, after 11, and then night, or night? 6 or 7. Oh. That night meaning not the okay. late night. Then you say the main dish, the, the two main meals. Uh, okay. When you say afternoon meal, do you mean lunch time? Yeah, yeah, lunch, lunch and dinner. So what lunch time and of yeah. your lunch? Uh, is it depends, time? like saying 11, 12, yeah. and dinner would be around 6, 7. It depends. I cannot uh, say exactly, you know, what time uh -huh. you yes. eat or I eat. It depends on, uh, like for me, for my home is about 6 in the evening mm -hmm. and morning is, uh, I mean, lunch is 11. That is my time. Do you still have the difference by the dish or the food now? Uh, yeah, we still have the So sometimes you eat fish and chips? Oh, no, uh, that, that no, we don't eat mm -hmm. fish and chips. Although we were influenced by the British, it doesn't mean that fish and chips was, uh, you know, introduced at that time. I've never heard because I was not born that time. Oh, I don't okay. know, okay. you know, at those times. It, it's too early for me to know, but bread, butter, jam, and yeah. ham, and you know, like all that. Mm -hmm. uh, and kind of... Uh, with the pork, uh, we still have this beef, steak, and all. You know, some people. So, what is the main meat that is used for cooking? Chicken. Yeah. 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 Uh, yes, majority, like she has said, chata. <laughs> chata meaning chicken. Chicken. And about seafood. Seafood. So, yeah, for we cook. And I want to tell you, this is very much related to our culture. Okay. Majority of the people in Myanmar don't eat beef. Oh, okay. Because we regard the cows as somebody very sacred, you know, who help us to grow rice, to do everything. So I would say majority doesn't eat. But here in Thailand, what I hear is that if you uh, pray to what tell me one aim, you don't eat beef. But for us, it's not that case. But we regard those animals as a benefactor who give us rice. So majority, I mean, I'm so my favorite. My favorite. My favorite. My favorite. My favorite. My favorite. And moon, or also the majority. Not majority, beef. I'm sorry, pork they eat. But majority is. For me, so chicken yeah, is the most popular, popular one then? For me, as uh, if, if I have to tell you my own experience, for me, I don't eat red meat at all. I just eat uh, chicken, fish. fish. That is it. I have not eaten that for 30 years. I don't eat red meat. I don't eat pork. How about vegetables? Is there a very variety vegetable or just we have like the, the vegetable that normally use for cooking? 
you have and there are the, the spoons are laid on, on those curry uh, dishes and then you just put it on Do you usually plate. eat at the same time? Uh, it depends, you know, sometimes. Based on your culture? Yeah, we, culture we like to, to have, to show our relationship. We prefer to eat together. But nowadays it's quite difficult. Yes. But we do try our best to eat together. So on the table we have like a, a snack for starter and then made dishes and then uh, or all like uh, no, 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 no. You, you cannot compare that uh, uh, to the English style, uh, to that of the Myanmar. We don't have starter and things like that as the main dish. You come at the same time. Yeah. So you eat like that, you have like straight food for something that we a snack, eat during the day, something like that. Oh yes, sure, snack food, yeah. On the road they are, right? Very well, similar. What is it? What is that? It's an apiochor. What do you do? You know, now we have at this day. Street food. Street namo ma yam na, namo ma. So we have. Namo bum, a chor, a chor, a chor, a chor. Uh, like, like you, you have this uh, hot, hot man, I like. Hot nam tao, hot nam tao, and then we have tour, 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 on the That's street. Mong Hing had to there on the street. But you ask for the snack, snack over here. Peya Jo. Peya Jo is like a chickpea that you know, ground yeah. and then fry it in oh. tea. Similar to that of Indian. And then we have samosa, like a triangle. That is the name that we get from India. You go to Indian food and you ask for some musa. Is this a lot of street food? Mm -hmm. Street food? Yeah, 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 yeah. Those, some people find it very convenient to just buy it. But I think in time there are more street food. have something like do and don't on the table? Mm, yes, when we eat, uh, we should not make sounds when we eat, you know, you have to make sure that, yes, we is that rude, isn't right? it? It's rude. It's rude. And like you, uh, let, like I had earlier said, we have this nam cha la pei jan on the table and we drink, drink together instead of water. Hot tea. Yeah, hot. Hot plain tea. Hot plain hot tea. Hot plain tea. Mm -hmm. Nam cha. Nam uh, cha. Nam cha. If I were to make a food and eat it, now I'll eat it and eat it and eat it. Is that to have something related together? Ethnic food. Uh, like we had earlier said, like in the Tanes Tanansi division, we have Omega. Okay, but different style. Uh -huh. And also in Arakanese, uh, uh, it's Arakan, you say Rakai, you say in Hassan Thai. They have Moinga, okay, but different style. Okay. Shan to different style. Uh -huh. So different style, but I, if I if I to ask your national food, that for the whole Myanmar, can you say five dishes that will be the whole Myanmar national food? What is the way? Okay, number one would be Mohinga. Mohinga. Yes, and we will be talking about the Tofu. Tofu, yes, yes. Mohinga. Can you explain and say something that I heard that Mohinga is the breakfast meal? Yes, yes, breakfast meal. Okay, what is the ingredient and what is it look like? Can you explain it? Yes, yes. You, you know this mohinga, yes. it can you can eat any time of the, oh, the day okay. you know, or any time. But then uh, I, for myself, my own experience, I have seen some people eat it in the morning instead of having bread and coffee. Uh -huh. A han chao, they eat this mohinga. So that more traditional. Yeah. Uh, that uh, the mohinga, you know, is similar to that of. But here, here is you have 
too long, long but us is very soft and warm, delicate. Uh, is it spicy? Uh, it depends on, because we don't put a lot of chili when you are cooking. Uh -huh. The chili is on the table, it. you can add it. So I would not say, uh, even kanom chili when I eat here, the kanom chin from the south is too, too spicy, oh, spicy. Too spicy. Oh, yes. right? And kanom chin from Bangkok is not spicy. I can eat. Right. So yes. uh, for us, is when we cook it, it's not very uh, so spicy. But it depends on the individual's taste. And if you want to add more to suit that tongue, then mm -hmm. that makes more sense. Mm -hmm. So the second dish will be. Ono cow soy. Ono cow soy. meaning we use the coconut milk. Ono cow soy is cow soy. Cow soy, yes. But why do we name it ono cow soy? Ono is the milk of coconut. And we add into the chicken. Are there look difference between your cow soy and Thai cow soy? A little, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. What I meant to say is that uh, the name derived from Ono Kauswe. What I meant to say is that the name of the Kauswe is Ono. What I tried to, I, I was trying to explain to you that Ono is, is the milk of coconut. The milk of coconut. And I'm yeah. What is Kauswe? Kauswe is the, the stream, uh, like the, uh, Mm -hmm. uh, the noodle, mm -hmm. the yellow noodle, mm -hmm. it is yellow noodle. Okay. Yellow so noodle. ono is milk, how yeah. is yellow, yellow noodle. noodle. So and then with the ingredients we put fish curry, uh, uh, sorry, fish sauce and, and uh, you know onions and everything like that. So for Thai people you can explain this like cow soy, right? Right, right, cow yes soy. you can say. If, if uh, a Thai who wants to get some idea yes. okay, if they don't look into the internet. I think if you look into the internet, it explains deeply <laughs> what it is like. Right? Okay. But then, if, if they have, no, have no idea, idea of what it is, uh -huh. then you can say that it's similar to the oh, 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 okay. And since, uh, uh, you know, Chiang Mai was under the influence of Myanmar, uh -huh. that may be the reason they use Khao uh -huh. and Khao and then Mohinga is similar to the or Kanon Jin. That is without the internet. I think if it is uh, the only council will eat during breakfast or lunch time or any time of the day. Time. Any time. Any time. Oh, any time. Okay. Morning or afternoon. So they yeah. are my favorite food. Oh, okay. <laughs> so the third dishes will be? Oh, Mohinga is we use fish. No. Whereas uh, Ono okay. Kauswe, we use chicken. Okay. We can use fish, Ono Kauswe, we use chicken. Okay. We will what chicken like? The big meat of chicken? Kaiban Aloy Kwan. So we will like uh, the chunk of chicken or like uh, the chunk of chicken? Chunk of chicken. Okay. okay. Here, in, in, if you go to the, you know, uh, Chula, Yes, uh, chicken broth. Chula, what is that? Kenchong. Kenchong. You will see the whole chunk of whole chunk um, chicken drum. Chicken drum. Yes. But whereas we use chunk. Not that a lot, not Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so the third dishes will be we have uh, Mungina, we have Onu Kong Suwe, and the other one. Nanjito. 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 Nanjito meaning it's a kind of a salad you put here. If you look into the internet, you will just find salad. But when you say salad, don't put your your mind into the salad that we eat in uh, in the West. What we mean by the salad here is we use the fingers and then mix it like yam or lap. Uh -huh. 
So this is my yam or oh, yeah, yeah, yes, yeah. Right. Okay. So with the ingredient will be noodle. You have noodle in Najito. Najito is yeah. the white noodle. White noodle. White noodle. White noodle. White noodle. Like udon. Like udon. 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 Similar to udon. Udon is bigger, but that is smaller. It depends to not big. What kind of and meat you put in? Or chicken. 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 Could it be mixed? All the meat. Yeah. No, 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 only chicken. Just only chicken. Uh, the curry, we have to make a chicken curry, special curry, and then mix with the uh, uh, oh, vegetable. No vegetable. No vegetable. Onion, onion, onion. onion. And then fried crispy noodle is at there. So that totally different compared to Western yeah. style. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, 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 right. Totally different. So that thing go when you normally eat with meat. Uh, afternoon, no, a morning, and when we have celebration, uh, oh, this is special. Uh, yeah, we, we can. Hmm? So for us now, it I eat in the afternoon. Uh, yeah, for me, there is no time limit. Okay. There is so no time what limit. is the festival you know we have? Uh, when you want to ce celebrate birthday or when you want wedding? to go to the no 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 not, not wedding. wedding. No 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 <laughs> wedding they have become very westernized. We serve it in a hotel. Oh, okay. But mm -hmm. if it is a village, uh -huh. a village wedding we might use it could be uh -huh. it depends. Village wedding. So you mean that it and then if you go local, to the temple local dish yeah, 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 local. if you go to local the temple and want to offer uh, to to the monks, we may offer mm -hmm. more and all no cost. So we got uh, Mohina for the first, we got Ono Kosuai, we got Najito, and what is the fourth thing? Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Pepeo mm -hmm. tomato, mm -hmm. fried rice using uh, the two the chickpea bean, the solid one. crispy one, not crispy one, the chickpea bean, steam it, steam it, and then, it. And then fry, fry it with the rice. So, uh, what is the taste like for a beer tomato? Tomato is just fried rice with a beer. So, uh, if you want to have it more in the medium, one. you will uh, put some the plain and, and black something one. like that. Very and plain. Actually, very plain. Yeah. Yeah. it depends on what you want. Like uh, from India, you have this um, <coughs> this mango pickle, like mango pickle and mango pickle, the other thing that I mango pickle and also we have this lime pickle to, to make it just more so okay, together. Is the bit. mango pickle have uh, like a side, uh, is a side dish? Yeah, yeah, it's a side dish. You can put it, it depends on. Okay. So, that is mint, do you have the every meal also or just it's it's some meal? In morning breakfast, in morning breakfast. How many morning breakfast? Morning breakfast. Morning breakfast. Okay. And it is uh, you know, everybody, no matter whether you are rich or poor, this is something that you can do it at home. Mm -hmm. So very economical mm -hmm. and very, I mean, all Handy people, food. Yeah, all people, mm -hmm. can, no matter what your level is. So it's like uh, if you don't know what to eat, come to the bit and talk to Yes, yes. <laughs> So I will take you to the Yama <laughs> restaurant Bello or into her restaurant. Okay. We have lots of restaurants. So I want to introduce my cousin here. Uh, her cooking is very good. Okay. So the, yeah. the the last one, the yes. fifth uh, what is it? Yeah, the petto. The petto is uh, it's you know, the petto existed not only now, during the time of the kings. And it is like you have to pick the green leaves, you know, and then you, after that, you dry it and you steam it and make it like a preserve, mm -hmm. preserve one, you know, preserve, yes, preserve one. And then when it's very soft and tender, you, like in the picture here, this is, this is the one. And then you may eat like, this is like a, the nuts yes. and this is, the dried um, prawns, mm -hmm. and then you eat like that, or you make it into a salad. You know, like uh, I had shown you earlier, you mix all together. So, and you can put cabbage, 
you know, and then you can put un, uh, not onion, tomatoes, mm -hmm. and then that is more fashionable. Now, for me, if I don't have anything to eat, I eat just rice and potato. Very popular. And like Pedro and Major, uh, this, the petto can be eaten by everybody, no matter whether you are rich, middle class, or poor. So it's very popular. It is so popular that it has become, in, uh, we have made it into like coffee three and one. You know, you have tea made of tea, tea made, uh, uh, green, tea. Green, green tea, you know, we have, and also that the petal is a salad, where you mix it together and eat it together also with rice. The green tea leaf, yeah. 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 But it, the green tea leaf must be a preserved one. Steam it and preserve it. Still it is seasoned. So the lapel will have any meal or? No, not meal, it is a kind of a dish. Uh, it is not included on the table to eat together with rice. It's up to the individual to eat any time. I can eat it now in my office. Oh, okay. I am sorry I did not bring the this pickle one. So Lapito seemed to be very healthy. Very food. popular and very healthy. Ah. You read in the have internet, you, have right? You, have you got a history of Lapito? Lapito, meaning uh, I cannot tell the history. What the, the, the history of La Pet is in pro. It derived from the leaves that we steam it, preserve it, and then when it gets into seasoned one, we make as a salad. Yeah. So the curry for the salad. Yes, and the pet of the salad. How about the sweet? You have your favorite um, sweet. Uh, what? Oh, 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 what is that? Um, yeah, you can explain. So, but she doesn't know how to do but I can. This is a Sonomakin. Sonomakin. Very sweet and very nice. Uh, in Myanmar, uh, in Abek. Uh, it is famous? Very famous. You can find it anywhere in Myanmar? Yeah, yeah, you can go to oh. shops. Oh, I'm at the zone. You can buy it. Very popular. I don't know, they use coconut juice and some kind of ingredients, so that I do. But what I can mention is that it's very popular. And you can go to Shrivazon, meaning Golden Pond, uh, shopping place where you can buy in very popular. How about the drink? What kind of drink is famous? The drink, is it green tea? As green tea, green tea, sweet tea, green sweet tea. coffee. Coffee three and one uh, tea. So okay. Okay, you, you have tea or coffee or just for me I'm a lover of coffee. Okay. It depends on the individual. Yes. But now tea is very popular. All the Thai people that go to Myanmar they say, Oh, you want royal tea? Mm -hmm. I was the one who introduced my royal tea. Three and one. Three and one coffee. So this is the famous one. Yes, right. right. <laughs> How about the drink with alcohol? We have like the traditional drink of alcohol. Oh, you have tanye. No, tanye. Uh, tanye, tanye we call it. Tanye is the, the way you write it. It's tanye. Okay. But when you speak it, you say tanye. Tanye. Okay, tanye. What is it? It's a nam nam tan. Nam tan. It's a cup of tanam from the nam tan. You, you, you go up and get it and then put it and drink. Uh, not in the house now, but people in the village do it. Uh, How about for the commercial? You have famous one? Oh, Myanmar beer. <laughs> very <laughs> famous. Yeah. Myanmar beer is very famous. Uh -huh. You have to drink when you get it. <laughs> okay, don't miss it, right? Uh, don't miss it. <laughs> okay. What about condiments? I think we miss something. When we have main dish, we have side dish, we also have salad and some other thing. How about condiments? For example, in Thailand, we have got fish sauce, we have got sugar, oh, we have got bacon, we have we got chili. Kapiye, like that. Kapiye is a fish paste, which we have. So that is your condiment? Yeah, yes. 
Then they have got um, the table all the time. Then, uh, like a mango pickle. Uh, pickle. Mm -hmm. So about the herbal food, what is your... We use, uh, every day we mango. use a beauty. Do you use food for cooking? Food for oh. cooking. Not that I know of. I think that I have a lot of food. I have a lot of food. How about durian? Durian is a popular? Very popular because we produce durian in the Tanao Sea International. I heard about durian jam. What is it? Ah, uh, it's the same. You said you you have not jam. You say uh, preserved durian. It comes in a stick. You grind uh, it. Only one, 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 one. Yeah, durian. Uh, wow. But the, the, not not jam because they have no equivalent meaning. So they just say jam. But there are other words jam.